fuck Elvis. <laughs> I can't go to the mall or a movie theater or something like that. Little kids or even adults get very vindictive. People stare at me and they take pictures of me. And... The other night I went to a 50s diner and I had a person walk up to me and go, are you one of them? No. <laughs> it's like I'm an alien or something. Are you one of them? Yeah, I'm one of them. <laughs> I do Elvis and stuff like that, but they walk up, are you one of them? I mean, that was really cool. I think the most irritating comment that I could, that I've heard is, you know, hey, there's an Elvis wannabe, you know. Hey, I thought you were dead, and I'll come back with a line, well, I'm not even sick. So, or, uh, or Elvis is dead, and I go, yes, that's why I'm doing it now, you know. Hey, Elvis, let's hear you say, Thank you, thank you very much, you know. Oh yeah, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much. And I, I, I get tired of that. I, I want people to hear his, the great voice that he had. I mean, he didn't sell a, a, a billion records saying thank you very much, and people way overdo it anyway. If you listen, listen to his records, he didn't draw it out like that. I mean, it sounds just like a normal person saying thank you, thank you very much. I mean, asking me about Lisa Marie and you know, and uh, Priscilla and all the other people that had anything to do with Elvis's life, and I'm like, I, you know, I try to stay in character as much as I could, but sometimes it's just, it goes beyond bizarre. It's funny when people see me, you know, they come up to me and they actually ask me if I notice himself, you know. While it's politically incorrect to ridicule religious or ethnic groups, poking fun at Elvis impersonators, sadly remains in vogue. Many people see them as mere parasites. Of course, uh, one of the most common put-downs of the Elvis impersonator is get a life. They confuse the fact that most people are, are impersonating somebody or pieces of different people as the basis of who they are. When we examine what's called identity uh, in sociology, we see how people construct who they are from a variety of sources and increasingly today materials of identity formation are derived from the medium. And uh, the Elvis impersonator is simply more honest about who has provided the role model of their personality.